Hello friends welcome to manuals.plus. Today we will talk about Lift Master Premium Series Garage Door Opener. Using the door control. Press the push bar to open and close the door. Light button. Press the light button to turn the garage door opener lights on or off. Programming control panel. Lock button. Press and hold the lock button for 2 seconds. The command LED will flash as long as the lock feature is activated and your handheld remote control will not operate your door at this time. Light button. To change the amount of time the garage door opener lights will stay on. Press and hold the lock button until the garage door opener lights flash. The time interval is indicated by the number of flashes. See the image given below. For activation, start with the garage door opener lights on. Press and hold the light button until the garage door opener lights turn off, then on again. Motion sensor. Slide the motion sensor switch on or off for activate or deactivate. To program a remote control, press the learn button on the door control to enter programming mode. Press the learn button again, the LED will flash once. Press the button on the remote control that you wish to operate your garage door. Keyless entry. Enter a four-digit personal identify cation number of your choice on the keyless entry keypad. Then press the enter button. Remote controls programming. Your garage door opener has been programmed at the factory to operate with your remote control. Press and release the learn button on the garage door opener. The learn indicator light will glow steadily for 30 seconds. Now within 30 seconds, press and hold the button on the remote control. Release the button when the garage door opener light blinks. It has learned the code. If light bulbs are not installed, two clicks will be heard. Erase all remote controls and keyless entries. Press and hold the learn button on the garage door opener until the learn LED goes out approximately 6 seconds. All remote control and keyless entry codes are now erased. Reprogram any accessory you wish to use. How you can open the door manually. Disconnect the trolley. The door should be fully closed if possible. Pull down on the emergency release handle. Reconnect the trolley. Pull the emergency release handle down and back. The door can then be raised and lowered manually as often as necessary. To disengage the lockout feature, pull the handle straight down. Programming buttons. The programming buttons are located on the left side panel of the garage door opener and are used to program the travel. How you can adjust your device. Press and hold the adjustment button until the up button begins to flash and a beep is heard. Press and hold the up button until the door is in the desired up position. Once the door is in the desired up position press and release the adjustment button. The garage door opener lights will flash twice and the down button will begin to flash. Press and hold the down button until the door is in the desired down position. Once the door is in the desired down position press and release the adjustment button. The garage door opener lights will flash twice and the up button will begin to flash. Press and release the up button. When the door travels to the programmed up position, the down button will begin to flash. Press and release the down button. The door will travel to the programmed down position. Now your programming is complete. Test the safety reversal system. With the door fully open, place a 1 or 1 half inch board in the floor, centered under the garage door. Press the remote control push button to close the door. The door must reverse when it makes contact with the board. Test the protector system. Open the door. Place the garage door opener carton in the path of the door. Press the remote control push button to close the door. The door will not move more than an inch, and the garage door opener lights will flash 10 times. For more information, visit our website, manuals.plus.